Sam Lowe here for irishboxing.com. Delighted to be joined by Fergus Quinn, the victorious Fergus Quinn here in the Fed of Fight Night. Fergus, that was a, a very fun fight tonight. Um, you won on points. Uh, a tough fight. How did you feel? Yeah, I felt good. You know, um, he's a tough man. I sort of knew that's what was going to, you know, I knew I was expecting that. Like, yeah. he was going to go the distance and he, he doesn't really get stopped. So I was sort of expecting that and I was glad just to get the rounds in, you know, and thought it was a good performance. Yeah, absolutely. Um, he was very tough, wasn't he? Yeah, he like took he some big shots. Like. Took some big shots off, yeah. And, I mean, to be fair, he gave a few back as well. Like he was a, it was, looked like a good learning fight in there tonight. Yeah, definitely loads to learn. You know, um, like he, he didn't just come and you know cover up. Like he came two shots back, and that's what I wanted. You know, so yeah, loads to learn. You know, there's a lot of absolutely <laughs> a lot of stuff to improve on. You know, but yeah, I was glad to get get out so soon after the last fight, get a bit of activity going on. And, Hopefully, build on it, you know. Absolutely, you have a few marks there, you got yeah. a few, you're bleeding there a bit. Yeah, well, I had a cut on my nose before, so I, it actually wasn't too bad. I was dreading it opening up, but it actually turned out not too bad. Yeah, it's grand, you got away with yeah. it a bit. Um, what's it like, kind of, you've, you've boxed here before, what was that like for you tonight? Is it kind of a special feeling or a special kind of occasion when you get to box kind of outdoors on it? You know, the Fela as well, which is a kind of very specific kind of festival, and yeah, what's, it, what's it kind it's, of feeling? It's unbelievable, like the atmosphere out there, like you can hear the noise, it's, it's incredible, you know, so, yeah, and to be so high up the yard, you know, just before Sean, like it was a great experience, and I brought a good crowd up with me, and gave them an entertaining fight, so yeah, good night all right. Yeah, the rain stayed away for night fights. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah, look at you, because it's after stepping the face down there now. Um, so what is next for you, like, obviously common, Common Boxing has a few shows in the pipeline and there's going to be a show in Dublin in, uh, I think it's in September, which is obviously very close. But kind of what's next for you and what, when, how soon do you want to be able to get? Yeah, well I suppose as soon as, like I'd be ready, you know, just finally getting a bit of, a, a, you know, momentum going and, you know, like I had a couple of years there of no activity really, so I've had four fights in the last 12 months, so I just want to keep building, keep improving, like they're the sort of fights you need to, to build on and improve on, you know, and, yeah, exactly. uh, friendly or tidy matchups or guys that you wouldn't mind getting in there with? Not really, like there's whoever they want me to fight for that fight sort of like I'm not picky, you know, but <laughs> yeah. uh, like I'm not, there's no one really in particular I would be that around, I'd be that massively interested in, but the, like if they throw a name out to fight for an Irish day, I'll like, accept it straight away, you know, so I'm happy to fight whoever for it. Yeah, you don't mind too much, do you? The super middleweight scene has kind of taken off a little bit in Ireland, hasn't it? You know, with the likes of a lot of the what you might call them, the local guys um, on, on the domestic scene, like Kevin Crown and these kind of guys, uh, Craig McCarthy, all these lads. Does that interest you, or are you kind of firmly set at middle? No, no, I don't. I wouldn't. If anything, I would be looking towards maybe super welter. You know, yeah. like um, too too small for super middle. I think so. Be middle super welter sort of thing. You know, but like that, every weight should be like them boys is that's the way it should be, they're all fighting each other and not afraid to take risks and fair play to them all, like it just it makes it more exciting for everyone, it makes Absolutely. for better fights and like everyone's, there's no losers in it, even if you come out coming the wrong end of the decision, you know, you're still getting the respect you deserve for taking them fights, so exactly. every every other division can take a leaf out of their approval, I think. Yeah, and they tend to be good fights as yeah, well, don't exactly, they? Yeah, Jamie Morrissey, yeah. Kevin Crowley, yeah, yeah, yeah. and all these guys. And everyone's enjoying them, fans are enjoying them and yeah, I think everyone should be at it. Absolutely. Um, so yeah, that's really it, isn't it? Like, what what's gonna be next for you this evening, for example? Like, I'm interested in what, 
How will you unwind now after this? You still um, around to watch the last two fights? Yeah, I'd say I'll watch the last two fights. Hopefully the boys do the business, like the more local boys that win, the better it is for the likes of me coming up, you know, more opportunities. So go out and cheer them on and then suppose I've a good little family and friends and that up, go and meet them after. And yeah. With a crack. Yeah, no with a crack, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Look, I'm not going to take up any more of your time. Fergus Glenn, thanks very much for talking to Archbox.com. Thank you. Thank you. Have a long time. Talk to you soon. Cheers. Thanks.